not being faced. A lot of teams would rush. The fans would start being, you know, panicking, like ooing and gnawing. But it's customary, and this is what the patience of Creighton basketball is all about. Games here in the Big East. Faber, first oh. three. Boy, Smith changed up and covered her on that defensive flow down the floor. Now, two for nine. Inside, that's eight points in the paint, and the first for Morgan Turner. That's what you wanted to see. Star in this game, and no one has been able to contain 45 on the floor. Nice little dish back, and that again is Audrey Faber being able to see over the defender and look at her options. Nice dip. Box out, grab that ball, and get that outlet quickly. Creighton basketball here started leading 12 to 3. It led Friday 12 to 2 against Villanova and lost, but a good burst of energy to start the second quarter. And Jalen Agnew has five points. Yeah, and like Smith that are going to need to step up when key teams start figuring out a way to key on White a little bit more. Somebody else needs to shine. And Creighton on the flip side trying to answer and put some breathing in room once again. When we talk about. Come, somebody's got to come back. Inside 10 to shoot. Turner wants it on the block. Inside Faber knows the timing so well. Knows the timing. Had the size advantage with two defenders leaning on her and Joel. She caught that ball almost underneath the hoop. That's a difficult, difficult catch and put up from that angle that she just completed that play on. Game and the clock ticks and it's low scoring. It continuously favors what Creighton wants to do. Second consecutive backdoor cut and a nice second assist for Audrey Faber on a, on a same type of play. Defender turns their eyes or looks the opposite way. Agnew quickly recognizes it, blinds it back to the opposite side and finds herself wide open. Three from Faber. 12 points from Audrey Faber and just like that, Creighton stretching its lead. No run to start the fourth against the Friars. Outscored Providence 23 to seven in that fourth quarter. Get themselves a road victory. They're hard to come by. And Audrey Faber doesn't want to give one up. That's 24 points for the senior. Look at that number, 28 threes a game on the year, but only 13 attempted today. 14 attempted today. <laughs> the bounces. Please and thank you. Home rims are nice rims. The crowd, crowd kind of went, uh uh, and then cheered. And uh, that one got the roll for sure. You miss the shot, you get the rebound, but how about the dump off by the, the walk on freshman, Dwarak? And take it to the rim. Peyton Brodsky. Brodsky dynamic on offense here. She kept that second chance opportunity of the three opportunities that the Blue Jays had.